Today I'm going to show you how to add a user to a hunt group in the manager program. So again, once you have opened a configuration, um, the first thing you'll see is the system tab here. And what we're looking for today is the hunt group tab under the configuration tree. So I'm going to go down so I see hunt group and I'm going to left click over hunt group once. And once I do that, you'll see all of your hunt groups appear here in this middle column. And then the hunt group that is highlighted, you'll see all of that information appear over here. What I'm going to do is I like to be able to see all the, the information on this hunt group. So if I take my cursor and, and place it right in the middle here of these bars, I can left click and drag it over to the left a little bit and just gives me a little bit better view for me. Okay. And then I scroll to the left down here to get even a better view. Okay, so extension um, 292 is our sales group. And what we have here on the bottom is we have all the members of the group. So the members are extension 204, 203, 207, and 206. Now what I want to do right now is I want to add another member to this group. So what I do is I need to scroll to the bottom. And if you notice down here, I can't really see anything. I see kind of a part of this rectangle. I want to see all of that. So I'm going to use this down arrow key on the right hand side of my screen. I'm going to scroll down and you'll see an edit button and you'll also see a remove button. We're going to work with the edit button first because we're going to add someone to this group. So I'm going to click on edit once, left click on it, and you'll get um, the, all the group members here and then other members here. So right now you'll see on the left hand side available users and those are all the users that are not in the hunt group. On the right hand side you'll see members and those of course are all the members of that group. So these are all the people that are in the group. So right now I want to add extension 208 and 205 to this side so that they'll become members of the hunt group. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to click on 208 one time, left click on 208. And in the middle, once I do that, you'll notice this append button. I'm going to left click on that one time and that'll put extension 208 into this group. And I also wanted to add extension 205. So I'm going to left click on it once. Again, I'm going to left click once on the append button to put him into the group. And then I'm going to press OK at the bottom of the screen. Once I do that, I'm going to scroll over here on the bottom. You'll see those two members, 208 and 205, are now added to the group. To make this live in the system, you're going to press OK at the bottom of the screen and then go to the blue disk or go to File, Save Configuration. Now, if I wanted to remove someone from the group, Right over by the edit, we saw the remove button. Right now it's, it's grayed out because I'm not, I have not clicked on a user to remove. So if I want to remove some from, someone from the group, I can click on the member I want to remove, left click on the member once, so it's highlighted, and then I'm going to scroll back to the right. And now you'll see that the remove button is not grayed out, so I can left click on remove once, and that took extension 208 out of the group. Another way to remove someone from the group is to simply press edit at the bottom of the screen. Again, you're going to get that list of all your available users and then all of your members. If I wanted to remove someone, like extension 205, I left click on 205 once and then select remove, left click on it once and then press OK at the bottom of the screen. And now I have successfully removed extension 205 from my group. Now to save this and make this live in the system, you press OK at the bottom of the screen. And then you either press the blue disk on the upper left hand corner or you press file save configuration. And that is how you add or delete a person from a hunt group.